uh, talking about balancing equations, looking at this first uh, equation here, this is it's a, I mean, this is a correct uh, reaction, so if you want to make water, you can combine hydrogen gas and oxygen gas. But if you just inspect the two different sides, you can see the number of the atoms is not balanced, right? So it's two hydrogens on the left side, two on the right, that's okay. But on the oxygen side, there is uh, two on the left and only one on the right, so we need to balance the oxygen. So one way to do that is to go ahead and say, okay, well, we make two, two water molecules. But now if we go back and check the hydrogen, there's only two on this side, four on this side. So we need to come back and balance the hydrogen again. And now is that one balanced? We have two times two, there's four hydrogens on this side, two oxygens. And on this side, two times two, we have four hydrogens and two oxygens. So that one is okay. So this is the balanced equation. And before we would do any kind of calculations on uh, molecular weight or, or, and so forth, we would want to make sure that everything is balanced on both sides. So to look at a more complicated equation, so here we have calcium chloride and silver nitrate going to silver chloride and calcium nitrate. Um, so first thing we want to check is, is everything balanced? If we start with the calcium, there's one here. There's one here, so calcium is okay. If we look at chlorine, there's two chlorine atoms here, nothing there. There's only one there, so we need to go ahead and balance the chlorine. And that's done by just adding a two there. So now if we check here, there's two, two times that one, there's two. So chlorine is good. And that didn't affect the calcium balance at all. So if we go on to silver, here we have one silver atom. Here we've got two silver atoms, so we need to balance the silver. If we go back through, that didn't change the calcium or chloride numbers, so calcium should be okay, chloride should be okay. We have two silver atoms here, two silver atoms there, so those are okay. If we check the nitrogen, so there's two, two nitrogens here, the N and the two, so there's two nitrogens, that's okay. If we check the oxygen, two times these three oxygens, that's six. And here there's O3 times two, that's six. So this one is finally balanced.